I'd been working on, a, on, a, on an idea for a, for a feature film where Dan and I pitched together at Trickerfish Animation Studios and, and sort of worked on it for a couple of years, just creating art, getting interest online and then sort of convinced a few friends to help out make a, a trailer, just a small piece of animation. It was going to be like only a few seconds at first, but it ended up being over a minute. Hmm. It took us about seven months to do. Yeah, and we um, did this sort of on weekends and yeah. in our spare time, <laughs> and there's about sort of four of us working on it. So I came to know about uh, Kariba um, of SA Creatives. Uh, lucky for us, we get sent the, a lot of the latest creative stuff and anything that's trendy, we'll know about it and we'll publish it. And the creatives sent us a teaser and this teaser is meant to serve as a proof of concept for a form that they want to eventually create. The story of Kariba centers around um, uh, a character we've created as the daughter of Nyami Nyami, who's the spirit of the Zambezi River Valley. And, um, and it takes place during the building of the Kariba Dam. And as you can imagine, it, it also takes place around this sort of, the, this, this clash of two worlds coming together. The, the sort of, um, uh, the, the Europeans sort of, and uh, uh, the stuff that they're building, and then what's happening to the people, and then there's what's happening to the river itself. And the history is really fascinating because the dam was destroyed twice um, by great floods and um, the, the local people said that this is because the river spirit was angry. And so our story really sort of examines why, why uh, did the dam eventually get built. I think that this should be considered as South Africa's most beautiful object and I know it's not an object in the sense of object, but I think it should be considered as the most beautiful thing because um, these guys were able to um, get into people's imaginations by creating a few seconds of content that was beautifully crafted with music that was beautifully put together and created something that 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 truly is inspiring. I mean the fact that just off those few seconds of film they were able to get funding to create their film uh, which they'll be doing in 2017. I think what we would like to do with uh, the film is, is sort of um, uh, redefine people's expectations of what kind of films and what kind of stories uh, uh, South Africans can tell and, uh, and to do something fresh you know, and, uh, and to sort of inspire the next generation of animated filmmakers with what we're doing. Some beauty is just beauty for the sake of being beauty and some objects is just functional. But um, I do believe that if something is beautiful, it already has a function and that function is to be beautiful on a pure level. <laughs>